Have you ever wondered what a front end, a back end, and a full stack developer is? In this video, I will make a simple demonstration using a web form. Assuming that you go to a website and you want to perform some booking, you go to the contact form, you enter information onto that form through the browser. What happens naturally is that the browser sends the information to a place that we call the server. The server processes the information and tries to talk to the database. And the database will send a response, whether it is good or not, it will send a response to the server and the server has the responsibility to talk back to the browser what has happened. The browser then informs the user either through a pop-up message that shows on your browser or you have an email or an sms but you get information somehow this is what naturally happens when you visit the form and these are the technologies that are used in the different parts in the browser we usually have the html and the css that give you the structure and style javascript is the one that makes interactivity between the browser and the server in the server we have a couple of languages we can choose one or two of them or many and the most common are python java javascript php c plus and Perl. On the database part, there are a lot of versions and different kinds of database, but the most common are SQL and MongoDB. The rest are just a dialect of it. So who does what here? Those who work with HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, these people, we call them front-end web developers. And those who master the server, programming languages, and the database, we call them back-end web developers. In some big organizations where they have money, they can pay, and they have bigger projects, they usually have some group of people who manage the database and this group of people are called database admin those who can manage all of these front end back end and the database we call them full stack web developers